Today's video is about the new Nordic renal diet for kidney diseases. All right, interesting diet. It was created for the Nordic countries, Finland, Iceland, Sweden, Denmark, all the Nordic countries are created for their type of a culture environment. And this diet has shown to help your kidneys. And I like this diet because I think it's more manageable, easier to follow than a lot of other kidney diets out there. So let's talk about it. That's what today's video is about. If you're new to the channel, make sure to subscribe look at all our videos, lots of things to help your kidney health. All right, so a little piece of research here. Uh, so this was from August, September 2022. Journal of Renal Nutrition. The new Nordic renal diet uh, induces a pronounced reduction of urine acid excretion and uremic toxins in CKD patients stages three and four. So what this diet is, and for these countries, in the, the Nordic countries, they have a high animal intake diet. So what they did was they gave them more of a Mediterranean type diet, which was more plant-based, and they looked at the results afterwards. Now, it was a short study. It was done in CKD three and four. They only did the study for about seven days, had the people on it, and then they reported the results, and they're still studying this now. So uh, in conclusion, here we report that patients in CKD stages three, four, seven days on the new Nordic renal diet significantly elevated plasma TCO2 levels, increased by carbon in the urine, reduced NAE, net acid excretion, and reduces the excretion of uremic toxins, IS and PCS. The magnitude of the diet mediated reduction of NAE is striking. Also shown to help uh, lower phosphorus, help with phosphorus control, phosphorus homeostasis. So this is a, a diet, I'm gonna go over the basics. If you're looking to do a diet like this, you would get a book on the Mediterranean diet and you would add more plant-based options. So you take out some of the animal products and add more plant-based. So if I go to the summary here, just quickly of the diet, plant-based 80%, okay? It's an 80% or greater, but at least 80% plant-based diet. Dairy intake is very low on the diet, okay? So maybe a serving a day. Fish intake is average, a couple times a week. Red meat was no intake for some people, but some people did have red meat intake. Um, and if you do, um, try to choose the lower phosphorus options, okay? So that's something you wanna look at. Nuts were also low to help with phosphorus control. Um, even though we know that uh, you don't absorb the phosphorus as well, but they went by the overall phosphorus number. And so that's the highlights, the uh, cover of the diet. If you're looking to do this diet, like I said, get, the, get a book on the Mediterranean diet and just make it about 80% plant-based, very small amounts of the red meat. If you do decide to use animal products, what they did in this study, use the lower phosphorus ones, turkey, chicken, lamb, uh, pork, okay, and leaner cuts, low-fat cuts are better, which they recommended. So that's the new Nordic diet for renal diseases. Interesting, something created, seems beneficial, more easier to follow. So if it's something you like, check it out. Let us know. Thanks for watching, everybody, and to your best kidney health. Bye.